Welcome back to my suburban garden. I'm Sheila. And I was up last night worried about my zucchini. So. I'm gonna have issues with pruning and, and bugs and airflow and disease and I didn't have a lot of problems last year, even though they were close together, except with harvesting. But it kept me up last night. So I did some research and I can grow them vertically. So what I'm gonna do, start thinking about how to do it, um, I'm gonna use scrap wood and I am going to screw it to the side of my um, bed and I'm gonna screw anchor screws in here and I am going to attach it with wire. If you haven't done it yet, like this video and subscribe. It really helps the channel. What am I going to do about the ones in the middle? You have to be careful you don't want to uh, sever the roots, puncture the root, roots in any way. So that two by four is not really gonna work. But I had these tea cups and you can get these, I think $4 for the, or $5 for the short ones. Costs a little more for the long ones, but about four to six inches from the roots. And, they're really only eight inches apart, but I'm gonna try to hammer this down and I'm gonna attach the wires to this. So if you don't have any scrap wood, you can just buy these. They're not that expensive. So what I'm gonna do is use my finger to kind of dig down in there, try to miss roots. That's a good spot. And I think that's a good solution. As they grow, I'll use the wire to attach it to either a two by four or the T post. And I that should solve my problems. So this has been my suburban garden. I'll see you in the next one.